the most important part and probably something that is you know the foundation of any properly thought out succession plan is to have all of the different stakeholders, whether they are reti- partners who are either in the next couple of years or maybe there's no timeline set yet, but people who will be retiring out of the equity partner ranks, and then a discussion with the people who will be coming into those leadership roles. And it doesn't have to necessarily, I don't want to spend every, think the entire focus on equity partners, non-equity partners, becoming equity partners. You know, oftentimes, especially at some of the larger, mid-sized, larger law firms, there are different people who are running the accounting and billing departments. There's people who are running the marketing end of the firm. Those people also need to kind of be included in, the, in an succession planning discussion. But I think the foundation of any good succession plan is to making sure that the, the people who are going to be departing at some point, the people who are going to be taking over those responsibilities are all on the same page as sort of what's, what's expected of them. 